G'day, Alan Tiller from Sci-Fi's Haunting Australia here. What could be more iconic in historic Port Adelaide than the lighthouse here on the wharf at the end of Commercial Road? Originally it was situated closer to the mouth of the Port River and was first lit in 1869 but later dismantled. Its parts were then used in other lighthouses. The original lantern was moved to Wonga Shoal but was later destroyed in an accident. The tower though, that was moved in 1901 to South Neptune Island where it remained in service until 1985. Later, the tower was moved to its current home in Port Adelaide and during restoration a time capsule was found with a bottle, a coin and a poem inside. These can be found in a nearby museum. Now I'm going to let you in on a little secret of the old lighthouse. There are rumours it is haunted, possibly by a former lighthouse keeper named George Marmont, who died fishing near the lighthouse in 1910. But other rumours lend to the spirits of two children, a boy and a girl. Who they are, nobody knows. Want to learn more about haunted locations in historic Port Adelaide? Pop into the Port Adelaide Visitor Information Centre and grab yourself a Ghost of the Port walking tour map and take a spooky walk through the streets of Port Adelaide. Or you can stop by the lighthouse and investigate for yourself.